The fun, magic, and excitement of Littlefoot and all his dinosaur buddies has returned in their fourth and most exciting adventure, The Land Before Time 4, Journey Through the Mists. In this wondrous tale, Littlefoot sets out for the elusive Valley of Mists to find a magic golden flower that could cure his sick grandfather. Well, he'll get better, won't he? I don't know, Littlefoot. Joining him in this exciting adventure are his pals Sarah, Ducky, Petrie, and Spike, and a newfound friend, Allie. Hello, Allie. Hi, hi, hi. She's a girl. This beautifully animated and heartwarming story is full of all the splendor, enchantment, and majesty that have made all of the Land Before Time releases so popular with audiences everywhere. And this wonderful tale is full of the same great music children who love Littlefoot have become accustomed to. So become a part of this great tradition of family entertainment and join the most lovable bunch of dinosaurs the world has ever known in a story you'll never forget. The Land Before Time 4, Journey Through the Mists. Deep within your psyche, there are fears. Fears you've never known. Until now. Face your fear. Jurassic Park. The Rock. Only at Universal Studios Hollywood. I said I'd be back. But this time it's not just a movie. It's for real. Get down! Or is it? Now. Join Arnold Schwarzenegger at Universal Studios for the world's first 3D virtual adventure. Terminator 2, 3D battle across time. An incredible new way to ride the movies, only at Universal Studios Florida. Hasta la vista, baby. What is it about whales that reminds us of ourselves? Why do we smile when we see a dolphin? Why do we want to protect them? Is it because they have children like us? Is it because they live in families like us? Is it because they are at once powerful? gentle or is it because deep down we know that if we don't protect them we can't protect ourselves
Water covers 80% of the Earth's surface, creates most of our oxygen, feeds the clouds so they can rain, and sustains all life on Earth. Unfortunately, today, almost every body of water on Earth is polluted, and every living thing has suffered. But fortunately, each of us has the power to help. We've already saved nearly half a million dolphins with laws you helped pass. And the number of lakes and rivers that are now safe enough for children to swim in has doubled. Remember, we have to protect our water and our neighbors that we share it with if we want to protect ourselves.